guys we have a gg in bow order as you can see from the tape although this part's kind of ugly because that's where my shipping label was uh you guys just saw a haul not too long ago it was her fall drop she did a back-to-back -back fall and halloween drop i think there was literally only like maybe a week in between maybe two so um i partaked in the fall drop i partaked in the fall uh halloween drop I partake in just about every drop. You guys know I love Gigi and Bo. She is an amazing small business to support. She's such a kind human being, truly. I talk to her all the time. And the Halloween drop was incredible. Honestly, all her drops are incredible. She's such a smart businesswoman, and she's just so creative, and I just love her designs. So, let's get right into it. When I open my box, this is what I see. So, right on top, we have the little thank you card with some stickers inside um i did order some stickers so let's see oh and then she has the order form right here love it nice and organized so let's pull this out so i can show you guys all the cute things so i will say you guys are seeing this on thursday i told you it was going to be a small business week as of today i'm filming this on tuesday monday monday she is having a sticker sale all her stickers are a dollar each. That is an incredible sale. I think I'm going to go back and buy some more. Um, because she is discontinuing her stickers. She said she has a big announcement coming. Um, her bookmarks used to be made to order. She used to literally make them by hand on her Cricut when she first started. She used to use Etsy as her platform. And she has branched out. She started her business in 2020 and it has blown up. I think I followed her. She had maybe 2K followers. Now she has over 20K followers. And she still makes the time to have great customer service, um, which I really appreciate because I know that gets harder the bigger your business is. And her business got so big that her be doing made to order just was not sustainable anymore. And now she gets her bookmarks made by a printing company, which allows for a thick her cardstock now that it's not handmade so i used to get all her bookmarks laminated if you watch my old gg and bow hauls now they are all cardstock because they're such a nice thick laminate uh thick cardstock that i love them so i'm wondering i don't know but i think that's what she's gonna end up doing with her stickers instead of made to order maybe it's gonna be from a company now Maybe that's what she means by discontinued. We'll see. I'll have to keep an eye on the announcement. I'll be linking her Instagram down below and her website because now she does have her own website instead of going through Etsy. But she still has her Etsy if that's something you prefer. So I did order just a few stickers because the girl spent a lot of money on this drop. And now they're a dollar each. I might go back and get some more. But I got this cute one that says Halloween Girly. You guys know I've been super into the bows. So I love that it's literally a bow on a pumpkin. You have two cute little black bats. A cute little moon. Obsessed. And then I literally just got one of each of her bows. Um, She did three for Halloween. And it's like the perfect orange and black halloween combo and then a purple one i always think halloween too i always think like i honestly think of a darker purple but i do really love this one um i always think of dark purple and green as well for halloween and then her card is super cute and it says hey boo and this is something i told you guys i will literally use these little note cards in my book journaling it is so cute even if i just want to cut out the ghosts or whatever and it says thank you so much for your purchase and supporting our small business use 10 percent joe that's like making a lot of noise over here please enjoy 10 percent discount on your next purchase autumn 10 if you guys want to order from gg and bow and has her instagram and her website which is literally gg and .com. And then, oh, look, I'll leave this here on the screen. If you guys want to scan it, it will take you right to go follow her on Instagram. Yeah, follow us on Instagram. And then our order is inspected by her staff. That's so funny, which is her two dogs. Literally how she named her business, Gigi and Bo, because it's Ginger and Bowie. All right, so under that little paper we got these things so this was actually part of her fall drop i really really wanted it but it was a pre-order and it was gonna um delay the shipping of my box and then i told myself i didn't really need it so i didn't get it but when it was still available for the halloween drop and she literally said she only had like two left i was like i'm just gonna get it and it is a koozie for a drink i actually have a drink right here so it's perfect Look at this. So now my drink will stop sweating all over my table. I literally need to keep this in my car. 
um because once in a blue moon not too often um i will treat myself to duncan and then i end up having a wet desk so i'm gonna literally put this right in my car tomorrow morning and i'm just gonna keep one in my car at all times but how cute is it it's a gilmore girls if you guys couldn't tell so it says no cell phones it has the luke's cup um logo his flannel his backwards hat lorelei's jeep pizza slices welcome to stars hollow sign i absolutely loved it and had to have it because you guys know i'm a huge gilmore girls fan especially this time of year oh, this is even a coffee pot um gilmore girls always gives me like those fall vibes and then now oh, not only did her uh is her company like not made to order anymore she goes through a company she also started selling other small businesses within her business so she has she calls it a gg and bow boutique so she had two items from another small business that she was selling with the Halloween drop. And one of them was these earrings by Sun-Dried Peach. They're these really cute clay earrings. And they're little white ghosts and little black bats. How cute are these going to look? You guys know I'm a teacher and I love ha like having seasonal items. I literally have a pumpkin and ghost headband that I've already worn a few times and got compliments. So I'll definitely add these little studs to my rotation. I'll show you the last item from the other small business last because it's at the bottom of the box. So just another little sneak peek. So we got bookmarks and we got that last item down here. So I always go a little crazy with her bookmarks. I have so many bookmarks. But I will say some of these are gifts. So I actually am not going to be able to show you every single one. This is a gift. So I'm going to put that one to the side. Um, You guys ready for a little sneak peek all right so I, even though i don't get them laminated anymore i do get them with a the tassel so you do have the option of laminated not laminated with the tassel without it with the tassel and you guys know like i said i have been feeling the bows so the first three have bows so i'll show you those so this one is just really cute peachy pink bows with like peachy yellow pink flowers I think the cats are making a mess or something over there. I don't know. Joe's dealing with it. And a green little tassel. I absolutely love that. Oh, and then there's these really pretty green bows too. Love that. I love how it's still fall, but we still have like the pops of pink. I really love that. Then we have this one that is definitely Halloween. -y. You got the black background. You got the spider webs, the pumpkins with these really cute pink bows. They really pop on the black. I love them with the pink tassel. And now her bookmarks are also double-sided, which I really love. And then this one, again, Halloween vibes. We got that light purple with the cauldrons and the bows, the stack of potion books, the crystal ball. I am obsessed. And then the purple and orange bows and even like a little white bow on the cauldron it is so stinking cute and then the one that didn't have the bows was this one so i believe this one was actually in her fall drop as well but i got a few bookmarks and I, went, I don't need another one but again it was still available for the halloween drop and i said oh it's still available i'm just gonna get it because you guys know i really love the checkered print and i will say on camera it looked like a stark black and white but in person it's actually like a cream which i prefer and yeah it's still black but it's kind of like a faded black it looks almost like a brown but i like it i'm not complaining and then i love the fall florals in the checkered boxes so that was the first little batch then the next batch we have the skull hands i love this one again i like the purple background I, she always matches the tassel, so we have like a creamy colored tassel to go with the skull hands. And I love that they're doing peace. Then we have this one, which is Hocus Pocus themed. Um, I actually do have Hocus Pocus 2, the book, which is very different from the movie, uh, that I started last year and never finished. So I'm going to try to read it this year. We shall see. Not putting too much commitment on myself because I am in a master's um program this year so it has been difficult i cannot wait to be done uh but if not whenever i read the hocus pocus i am definitely gonna use this bookmark and this is just you know vibes any witchy book it doesn't have to be hocus pocus but i love that you have the outline of the hair of the three witches you have the cauldrons the broomsticks the famous book um the potions the candle so stinking cute and then the last little bookmark package here 
make sure none of these are gifts. No. Okay. So it was only one of them that was a gift. Is the Skull Cherries. I love this one. And I know she said she was even surprised. She wasn't sure if it was going to be a top seller. And it was. I, You guys know the cherry print has been so in. And I love that she turned the little cherries into skulls. And instead of like a bright red. They're kind of like a darker. Almost like. Not darker. Like a lighter pinkish red. I love that. It's like so subtle but so cute. Then I got this one this is so like in right now where it looks like it's wallpaper i am obsessed it's, it looks like like literally like vintagey wallpaper and you have the little like candelabras that people used to carry around the little ghosts and the little bows on the pink background with the pink tassel this one is kind of like the psychedelic disco ghost <laughs> i'm obsessed with this one it is so stinking cute i love they're wearing their little glasses we have the disco ball the pumpkins the candy corn the peace signs the little spiders again super cute she has amazing designs and then the one that i saw she does sneak peek sometimes on her instagram stories and i saw this like way before she announced the halloween drop like literally when she was talking about the fall drop she got a box of bookmarks in and she put guys they're in and this was in the box and i went oh my god i have to have that and it is this is the back so you can see her logo so this is actually the front and it is the pillsbury cookies so we have the black cat the purple ghost and the orange pumpkin she actually had the orange pumpkin as a pop socket if she had had the purple ghost i would have got it it's my preference or even the black cat the orange pumpkin's probably like my least favorite um you know i have to have as a pop socket but this bookmark is gorgeous novel stitches has a book sleeve that matches this right now and it's taking everything in me not to get it because you guys know i love supporting novel stitches i just did a haul for novel stitches but i'm really it's not showing in this haul because i bought a lot of things for myself but i am really trying to focus on christmas presents right now and i did get one thing that's a christmas present but oh, i loved this one and then last but certainly not least literally the thing i am like most excited for i'm probably gonna wear a day this week is her item from another small business so this is from some i think it's sabrina threads i'm going to link her individually down below because i love her sweatshirts i have one i actually won in a giveaway she does carry plus and i wear that sweater like crazy it is my favorite it is embroidered on guys this is not vinyl this is literally embroidered on i have the one that says lily blooms florist with like a little lily and it's obviously from it ends with us she has a lot of bookish themed sweaters um and i told myself i was like oh i'm so glad i won it in this giveaway i know the 5x fits me one day in the future i'm gonna invest and buy another one because i love her sweatshirts so i've got to do that except through gg and bow and it says read more books and it's a heart with the ghosts and the books i love it she only had it in gray well i'm lying she had a few white that she ordered by accident i guess in smaller sizes but for my 5x i got it in the gray and i absolutely love it and this is something i will wear year round not just for halloween truly because it's book themed and i love little ghosties but that is everything for my gg and bow haul and i'm so happy i not only got to um support britney but i got to support two other small businesses through britney's shop um i will link gg and bow down below i'm gonna link sabrina threads i'm not sure the exact name of it but it's something along those are uh, threaded threaded by sabrina Sabrina, I believe that's what it is. I will link Novel Stitches as well, even though um, obviously I did talk about her in this haul, and she's another great small business to support. If you're thinking Christmas presents and you have some readers in your life, you want to get them a nice book sleeve. I actually, my last order, you guys saw not that long ago, literally last week, if I remember, I'll link the video. I mentioned that one of the sleeves I couldn't show you guys because it was a gift. Um, so I have been buying things for myself, um, but a lot of the orders is like, oh, I'll get that as a gift, and then I'm like, okay, what else can I get for me? You get free shipping. <laughs> <laughs> gotta treat yourself too and this was definitely a treat myself i always treat myself a gg and bow um because i just love her designs i truly truly do these bookmarks are literally incredible and they don't take up a lot of space so if i have to have 
an addiction to something, I guess it's not bad to be addicted to bookmarks. But that was everything for my GG and Bow haul. Check out all those links down below. Let me know what your favorite item was. Is it the sweatshirt? Is it the really cute little earrings? Was it the coffee koozie? Or was it the stickers or the amazing bookmarks? Check out the links. Maybe the sweaters, stickers will still be on sale when you guys are checking this out. She's literally doing $1 stickers, which is incredible. I'm literally going to go look right after this. Um, and that is it for this video. You guys are watching this on Thursday. Tuesdays and Thursdays are on my unboxings and hauls. Monday is book club. Wednesday is what's up Wednesday. Friday's a vlog. Saturday is my outfits of the week. So I'll do a little bit of everything on this channel. Some plus size fashion. Following my everyday life. We get support small businesses. We do, um, you know, regular big box stores as well. I get Fab Fit Fun. I get Goldie Box mystery boxes i have an advent calendar coming in soon for you guys so if any of that sounds good definitely consider subscribing hit that notification bell so you're notified next time i upload if you like the video like me give it a thumbs up it really helps with the youtube algorithm helps get those small businesses out there novice which is actually has a code that because she's an ambassador for um gg and bow and i use her code to support her too as well i believe it's michelle 10 i will link it down below um i did say you could use thank you 10 but if you i uh, know this one's autumn 10 but if you want to directly support somebody, um, definitely consider using Michelle's code. Um, she, and then if you go to Gigi and Bo's page, she has all her, all her um, brand reps. So you can go check out all those amazing women. Um, but I definitely love supporting Michelle and Brittany. They're two of my favorite, favorite small businesses. And that is it for this video, guys. Be safe.